In this screencast, we will look at the basics of setting up a deployment on CrowdMap and modifying some of the basic settings like changing the title, tagline, and default map view of your deployment. If you already have an account, you can sign in above and create a new deployment from there. However, we're going to create a deployment as a new user. So all we need to do is click on sign up for free and we'll have our deployment operational with basic functionality in only a few minutes. So what we're going to do here is just register some simple information about us. And create a username and password. Now the username for crowdmap.com is going to be your email address. Next, we need to create the URL that we're going to use for our deployment. On CrowdMap, you get your own subdomain with your deployment. We're going to call this one Tutorial. So the address for our deployment will be tutorial.crowdmap.com. And then finally, we need to give it a we need to give our deployment a name and a tagline and accept the terms of service. So on this screen we will see a list of all of our deployments. We want to get right to it and start modifying our deployment so we will cover settings on this page in another screencast. I'm going to open two tabs, one with the front end of our new deployment and another with our admin dashboard. This is our crowd map with default settings. Since our organization was born in Kenya, the default starting location is Nairobi. However, there's a good chance you would like to have your map centered somewhere else. We'll get to that in just a minute. Now let's take a look at our admin panel. You can see here that we need to log in. Every deployment created on the CrowdMap system is a totally standalone copy of Ushahidi, which does not use a universal login. What this means is you manage user accounts on each deployment separately. Managing users will be covered in another screencast. For now, we just want to log in and get going. The default login is going to be the same as your crowdmap.com login when you created the deployment. When we first log in, we see the admin dashboard. There isn't much to see here since our deployment isn't being used just yet. Let's go ahead and change some of the basic settings in the settings tab. As you can see here, we have our site name and tagline at the top of the settings page. Let's say we want to jazz things up and add an exclamation point to our site name and tagline. We can do that here and simply hit save. There are more settings here if you would like to explore on your own. Now about that map. All we need to do is click on the map settings link and make a few modifications. If your deployment is collecting reports in only one country, you can select a default country from the drop down here. However, if you're going to be collecting reports and placing them on the map globally, you can simply leave the country selection alone and pick yes right here. CrowdMap is designed to give you flexibility in your mapping provider. To change this to say, OpenStreetMap, simply select it from the drop-down in the map provider selection. Next, we're going to pick our default zoom and center for our map. I'm currently in Louisville, Kentucky, so I'm going to pick my location. Let's zoom out using this slider, clicking where you want the center of your map to be.
There we go. Now let's save our settings and then see our changes on the front end. I'm going to refresh the page. As you can see, our site name, tagline, and map view have all been set where we want them. Thank you for taking the time to watch this screencast and good luck with your deployment.